Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel Crazy for Fishing Insane, my name is Juan. Guys, I'm back at it again On the hunt, on the hunt guys This is low, 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 low I should have been in here three hours ago But we need to work it's, It is low tide now guys Not one hour before, not two hours before, it is low tide I should have been in here long I should have been in here a long time ago couple hours ago but we need to work as well but uh, hey we need to fish we need to fish guys and uh, guys who are new to the channel to my old subscribers thank you so much for all the support guys and I'm going to mention this again guys to all my old subscribers I'm gonna ask me why why do I always mention the rigs and everything in the old videos because there's some new subscribers and some new guys who's probably going to subscribe now hopefully thanks for the support if you do subscribe now guys that don't know the rig so guys if you haven't watched that video yet i'll put the link in the description below that rig most definitely works wonders i pull out that nice nice little corp guys I'm not can't say little anymore it was a uh, measured 105 centimeters guys I need sorry I need to can't look at the screen I'm rushing in here now I don't want to fall down so guys if you haven't seen that rig I'll put the link in the description below so you guys can see the cob rig that I'm using oh, not almost there pretty far away to go as you guys can see but I'm doing my intro I've been in, in a bit of a hurry to get there because I need to go back to work as well guys just bear with me bear with me I'm gonna see if we can catch a couple of cob with the small ones we release them guys like I always say you know let them go let them grow they need to be 50 centimeters to keep but uh, if there's a baby cob about a 48 centimeter it will still be a fight I'm trying to put out some good footage for you guys. Uh, let's see, where are we now? Uh, I need to find my spot. As you guys can see, it is low. It is low. How low can you go? Anywho, I'm going to see you guys when I'm at my spot. No, at a spot. If I don't fish, don't catch anything. We need to move, guys. Don't stand there for an hour and you don't catch anything. Cop moves around. Just explore. You guys need to explore the holes. Explore the holes, guys. The whole coastline for me, yeah, it's not as deep, not as scary. It is low tide. But normally the best time to come in is about three hours before low tide. If you are not experienced, don't do it. You'd rather wait for low tide. And then you come and fish but uh, the guys who are experienced I don't even have to tell them they need to get in here three hours before low tide because they know but there's a lot of people you don't know a lot of people who want to do some fishing new guys who wants to come here and explore and do some freedoms catch some fishing and let some some fish go guys it's for the sport if you want an edible just make sure it's a legal size guys check out the sizes for the cob and all the legal sizes for the fish and everything Woo, let me get in here i'll see you guys in just a bit Fish on boys, fish on! Woo! 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 Here it comes! Woo! 
Beautiful coffee guys. Absolutely beautiful. In the eyeball guys. Oh man, I, I didn't mean for that to happen, but uh, crazy things happened here on the reefs. But in the eyeball, but I believe he will still survive. Let's give him some freedom. Let's give him some freedom. Freedom, 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 freedom. What a beautiful day to have a beautiful day. It wasn't legal size, guys. We gave it some freedom. Let them go, let them grow. You guys saw in that other video how big they can get. But it's a fight, guys. It's a fight. We're doing it. We are doing it for the sport. It is low tide, guys. Low. As you guys can see. Where's the big fish? Only babies. Okay guys. Alrighty then, let's move. Only got that one small little cobble yo. Now I'm gonna change spots. Hunting guys, I'm hunting. <coughs> Only that small small cobby came out. So now going to scout these reefs and see if I can find a bigger cob a nice little edible if they are small we do release them guys let's go I think the water is starting to push now it's still low you can still walk here but I think it's starting to push. I'll see you guys in just a bit. Too short, boys. Too short. Oh, I'm stuck. Stuck on the reef. Got stuck on a reef. Oh. I'm all the way there, guys, in the beginning. Now I'm all the way here. Got a fish on, got stuck on the reef. Ah. Not good. Woo! Woo! Fish on! Got suck again. Here it comes, guys. Woo.
There it goes, freedom! Uh, this reef here in front of me Every time it gets here it gets stuck But only small ones guys Small caballo Imagine if I, have a, if I have a big one on I will lose it here in front Already lost one small one Struggle with it Came out Just lost it here in front of me Anywho was well, a small any case but uh, they're biting at this spot but I moved around guys I was all the way there and I came all the way here and it seems to bite here but there's a terrible reef here in front of me I'm struggling to get the fish out maybe I should go and stand there it doesn't seem like doesn't seem like there's a reef there in front only a small one there's a big one here in front of me and I get stuck every time <sighs> crazy I need to get out of here Okay guys, believe it or not, this is the next day. I got stuck in a crazy reef in front. I've lost two fish. But this is the next day. And uh, I'm here with my son. I'm here with my son Monet. I'm here with my son Monet and uh, gonna see if we can do better than yesterday.
the rig that I showed you guys. You guys haven't seen the rig before, like I mentioned before, I'll leave it in the link in the description below. This is what I use to catch Cobble Yo. As you guys can see, here's my hook line, my floaty, and here's my sinker. And it's going to be a sliding sinker, guys. I don't know if you guys can see this. There's my FG knot with my leader line. So what happens now, first you put your sinker, so what's going to happen now is first you put your sinker, as you guys can see it's sliding, so now you make your knot for your hook line, and this is, not, this is the knot that I use guys, I don't know if you guys can see. What I do is I keep a little loopy here and I just fold it over and then another loopy and first through the first little loop put it a little bit tighter and then through the second loop you guys will see now how it tightens. There you go ready and this is what happens and what happens is when the cob is on guys if you the cob pulls the sinker goes up and you pull and the sinker get away from is getting away from the ground from the reefs so you must so if you you're most likely not to get stuck guys because if you pull you pull the cob then you guys will see the sinker lifts up lifts up from the ground so it's not gonna get stuck on the on the on the reefs Short. got stuck again here it comes guys Woo. Okay guys, so you guys are probably thinking why is the sinker not working here? It's a completely different story. The reef is on top of the water, it's not underneath. So underneath the sinker will most definitely work. This reef is sitting on right on top of the water, so it's much most likely to get stuck. Anyway, I hope that's helpful guys. Let's see, second day here on the reefs, let's see if we can get an edible. I was chasing edibles yesterday, but uh, nothing guys, only small babies. And uh, let's try this again. Get you guys some footage, get myself a little edible. If you guys want to see how I do the FG knot, guys, how to tie your, your leader line to your braid, just leave a comment and I'll do a video on that. It's pretty easy, quick and easy. We have to do it quick and easy because on the reefs, if you do break off, if it does happen, then uh, you have to do it quick. So leave a comment if you guys want to see the FG knot. Let's go on the reefs. I'll see you guys on the reefs.
push on, but uh, my dad says it's a high. Oh, the shark, yeah. Not sure, it's fighting, but it's uh, really heavy. Try and get it on GoPro. It's a Bronte! It's a Bronte! Come here, so. Yeah. <laughs> Can you believe it? That's beautiful. Come <laughs> here. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Give it some freedom. Oh, okay. How many are you? Some freedom. Go, go, go. Gone. It uh, seems like a big one, guys. Go check it. Don't know what it could be, but uh, it seems like a big one. Oh, it's underwater. Here it comes. Oh no, he's heading straight for me. What the hell? W! Yeah. Beautiful coffee guys. Absolutely beautiful. Oh. See you guys, 50 centimeters. It's definitely 50 centimeters guys, absolutely beautiful. Now I say these guys are beautiful to eat. About 50 centimeters, absolutely beautiful. Mm. Yeah, by the way. I I just lay all the other water scenic because it covers you. Yeah. Okay. Wait. <laughs> okay guys, as you guys saw, my son came with me, so that's where the footage is coming from of today. But absolutely crazy, let's do this. Okay guys. Oh, okay. Okay guys. Oh, okay. Okay guys. So, we're leaving now. Oh, yeah, we're leaving now. Because, no speed. That's what a uh, bronze and a small club, a legal size club. Uh, oh, yeah, legal size. I can't even concentrate talking to you guys because I'm falling around. That's what it is. I'm freaking cold as hell. Just want to get out of here. Oh, yeah. Going on YouTube, mate.
50 centimeters guys absolutely absolutely beautiful anyway it's the only uh, fish for the week guys I only got one size I released a couple for this week I'm posting this video today and today is Friday guys but this is what happened on Monday Tuesday and Wednesday Yay! okay this is what happened on Monday Tuesday and Wednesday so I always go out guys to get you guys some footage and obviously get myself uh, a nice edible guys please subscribe you don't have to catch me up upcoming videos if you guys just subscribe you guys will really help me out uh, but I don't want you guys to subscribe for free what I'll do is I will give you guys some good content and tell you guys and show you guys what's going on here on, on our coastline and uh, guys if you do subscribe it's for free guys you don't have to pay for it Guys, yeah, something happened there with that, with that shot. Anyway, uh, crazy, crazy world we live in. Okay, you guys, only that one fish, one sizer, and that's it. As you guys know, that my son came with, he gave us some great footage. I've got us some great footage, guys. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll try and post the video every every Friday, guys, but it's difficult sometimes otherwise it will be every second every second week but at least you guys know what's going on on the reefs there's any any fish but uh, as you guys see now I went on Monday Tuesday and Thursday but anyway I posted a video now it's Friday so I posted a video posted the video so on a Friday so you guys know what's going on during the week and this footage I got during the week Monday Tuesday and Wednesday so, okay guys, please subscribe with the notification of upcoming videos. Cheers.